when you receive your NC forge, remove it from the box. This is your paint sheet with instructions 1 through 8 how to assemble. This is your burners and your feeder tube. Your quick light, which is your igniter. Your ball valve. 57L and two piece tank connector, pressure gauge, regulator, hose and Teflon tape, forge handle. Remove the bolts from the top of the forge housing. Work your burners into top of the forge housing. May have to rock back and forth. Return the bolt. Place your quick light in the burner that has the pilot hole for the quick light and return the bolt to it also. Gently tighten down. Tape the threads of the feeder tube with the Teflon. Three rounds of Teflon is required on all threads. Place the ball bow onto the threads of the feeder tube. Gently tighten as well. Your regulator is marked in and out clearly on the bottom. The in is for the two piece tank connector and the out is for the 57L. Tape the threads of the two piece tank connector. Insert to the side that is clearly marked in on the regulator. And tighten down. Tape the 57L and insert into the side that is clearly marked out the gas blowing out to the forge. Tighten down also. Remove the bolt from the gauge port. Tape the threads of the gauge insert to the gauge port. Tighten the gauge so the gauge is facing the top of the regulator towards the T-handle.
tape the male end of the hose insert into the ball valve and tighten up. The female end of the hose will tighten onto the 57L coming from the regulator. Inserting the two-piece connector into the valve of the tank. Open the valve of the tank. Adjust your T-handle on your regulator to your desired pressure. Then check all your your fittings for leaks with a spray bottle of soapy water. Place your forge handle into the bolt that is welded to the door of the forge. Open the door of the forge, turn the ball valve on, and click your igniter. Cut the forge off. Turn the valve of the tank off to shut the gas off from the tank. Okay. 